Barn Hunt Vault. Now, we've got the Drake Waterfowl Refuge Blind Bag. This bag right here. There. Open it up. Looks pretty nice. They buy you this at 35 bucks. I think that's reasonable. And then we have the the goal zero power bank. Now um, it says it's made for an iPhone on here. It seems redundant because it seems like we're getting a lot of these from them um, power banks And I've gotten like three I think so far um, And not just like in in one box, but you know in, in different boxes not that like the same um, Month or anything just like Month after month that seems to be a theme of having having one of these in here um has built-in cables on this one. Um, I think the last one they sent us was actually solar, um, solar powered, but this one is not. Uh, so uh, this was valued at thirty dollars. Next, we have the hybrid light, um, which again, I believe I've gotten before. Um, it is, you know, you can charge it solar powered with the, the solar um, panel here, um, which is great if you're planning ahead. You know, if you are going camping, make sure you charge it before the sun goes down if you need it that night. Um, that's valued at $30 as well. The Drake Waterfowl face mask. Um, this this feels uh, pretty thick. Uh, I imagine this is going to be nice and warm this winter. Um, this is valued at twenty dollars. We either have a Kula Buck Blood Red game bag, or we have a body bag and game spray combo. We got the Kula Buck heavy duty cotton polyester blend double stitched game bag cool this is valued at seventeen dollars next we have a apps outdoors tri leg stool right here comes in a nice case tri leg stool these come in handy um, I have several of these actually I'm a fan of them um, not necessarily this brand but I do have several tri leg stools and that is valued at $15 then we have the Kershaw Cinder Keychain Pocket Knife. Oh, it's a little fella. Right here. Very small. And that is valued at $13. And then they say as a bonus we get the weather resistant five year anniversary sticker, which I'm guessing is this sticker. 
that they say is worth five dollars and then the bugle bee sticker that they say is worth five dollars i will not be giving credit for any stickers in these boxes when i do the breakdown on numbers um so i will do the breakdown and we will get back with the cost all right we've got the breakdown on the hunt vault elite box for september um the drake waterfowl bag hunt vault says was worth 35 bucks pretty much dead on it was 34.99 from what i could find uh the gerber freeman knife um they said it was worth 32 bucks which i thought was a good price but i was able to find that actually for 23.99 um so i was able to find it a little cheaper the power bank they said it was worth 30 bucks. Um, I was able to find the exact same one for $25.90. Um, the hybrid light flashlight, um, which I have gotten that before, um, was worth 30 bucks according to Hunt Vault, but I was able to find it online for $24.85. Uh, that all these numbers are shipped too by the way so this is after you pay shipping and all that stuff um the drake face mask uh, they said it was worth 20 i found the exact same mask again it was 20 they were dead on with their price on that one the game bag i was a wasn't really able to find that exact same game bag um i did find the same brand um but a bigger package that cost a little bit more um but it had more bags in the package so what i did was i just went ahead and gave them the value that they said it was worth from hunt bought hunt bought says it was worth 17 bucks so i gave them that value um the the tripod stool um was able to find the exact same one online for 22.34 um that shipped and they said it was worth um 15 bucks so uh, we actually they actually undervalued that a little bit um and then the kershaw cinder keychain knife uh they said it was worth 13 bucks i was able to find that for 11.31 shipped so um all in all the totals they said their box was worth 192 bucks um from what I was able to find, if you bought it all separately, you were going to spend about 180 bucks and 34 cents. Uh, so not quite as much as what they said it was worth, but still only paid 160 bucks for the subscription box this month. Um, so you still get a little more than you paid for. Although I do feel like that margin could be a little bigger. Um, I feel like you know saving 20 bucks on selected items i think that number should be closer to the 200 dollar dollar mark um, but that's just my personal opinion overall they still did a good job the the items quality of the items i think is good and um and you still got more value than what you paid for so that's always good as well uh, if you like my videos don't forget to hit like and don't forget to subscribe i will see you next time